Neyland Stadium serves as a backdrop for graduation pictures as COVID-19 sidelined UT football, impacting businesses in a devastating way. This time of day, um, you would hear Rocky Top playing. You'd see a sea of orange and white, smiling faces, whether Tennessee's winning or losing. Empty seats in Neyland Stadium, empty seats in Buckethead Tavern. With the game being canceled, we've had very few people in throughout the day. There hasn't really been a whole lot of foot traffic in or out. Home football games play a big part of the local economy. A UT Athletics report from 2016 shows that Knox County brings in a whopping $42 million in tax revenue when the Vols play at home. So, in uncertain times, these games serve as hope that businesses, big or small, can fight another day. When they vanish, it's a chilling blow to those trying to make it. It is scary. We don't have a large financial backing to aid us in the down times. You know, we're running lower in production, but still trying to push through. But Despite the continued effects of COVID-19, this business remains resilient. We here at Buckethead, we like to stay positive no matter what. Live to fight another day. Every smiling face that comes in the door, every seat that's sat in is for us a positive thing no matter what. In Knoxville. Malik Jackson.